we've already started the work towards the, the recertification process. And uh, when we started the training with Parallel and Dr. Julian Marr a couple of weeks ago, we started to start talk about the power of choice. And uh, we have basically two choices in life. We can choose to be in the red box, which is the negative side, or we can choose to be in the green box, which is the positive side. And every one of the employees here at Baby Subjects gone through this training and we all know the consequences of the power of choice. We can choose to be miserable all day or we choose to be happy all day. We can choose to give excellent service to get valuable rewards or we can give ordinary service to get little rewards. And uh, I know, I feel confident, I feel sure that we as a team want to be on the winning side of excellence. And uh, with your help, with your encouragement, with your support, we will come to that bridge and cross it. So I want to thank each and every member of staff for coming out today. And uh, of course, we cannot have done this without the support of the CEO and the viewer, the college friend. Excellence is the gradual result of always striving to do better. I'll repeat that. Excellence is the gradual result of always striving to do better. And I like this quote in the context of hospitality assured because it suggests that pursuing excellence is an ongoing step-by-step -step and day-by-day -day endeavor. To want to improve at the I level, each of us individually, at the we level, the team, and at the organizational level as well. And that there is continuous effort. It takes effort eh, to strive for excellence. Effort, commitment, and discipline that is a part of the process as one strives to be better. And the Hospitality Short Program builds in that commitment to continuous improvement on the road to excellence in that this institute, this, this organization has to face an external assessor every two years and demonstrate in ways that are measurable that it is on a path of continuous improvement as it strives to provide service and business excellence. In fact, um, before I left for St. Kitts, one of um, the businesses in Barbados already contacted me and said, we want to put it in our budget because next year we will be up for um, recertification and we want to make sure we put it in our budget for next year. So they were checking on that already. So once again, on behalf of the Caribbean Tourism Organization, I want to congratulate Debbie Southend's Beach Resort, Mr. Alvin Gemma and his team for attaining the Hospitality Assured Certificate.